<laughs> How long is this gonna last? <laughs> We're gonna be here all day. <laughs> and with Juno coming over, <laughs> I really wanted you to meet some of our Korean friends' kids as well. What's crazy is two of our friends both have kids that were born within a month of Juno. Okay. Juno, well, we're going to go make some friends. Do you want to do that? <laughs> and Juno, we have a present for you to give your new friends. <gasps> oh, yeah. Can your I hold your balloon? favorite strawberry. Is it the little boy? Yeah. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay. Yeah, it's a present. And Juno, we also got some big, heavy pears. Wow. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> Yes, we are. Yeah. They are born within a month of you, so I don't know if you calling them little boys is quite accurate, but they're new friends. Yeah, it's a power move, John. Yeah. <laughs> Just establish dominance. Establishing right. Yeah. Do you want to knock on the door? Knock on the door. Oh. <laughs> okay. All right. You ready? Look. Hello. Oh. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. You're welcome. Wow. I take you my shoes off. Good girl. You know you need to take your shoes off in a Korean house. Hey, Yummy. Hello. How you doing, man? Hello. Good to see you. I feel Yonu. Yonu. So good to see you. Yonu, who you may have seen in a Jolly video, he's the, the maker of the books that Ollie uses to study Korean. Yeah. He invited us to his house, which turned out to be almost entirely kid-proofed and the perfect place to hold a play date. Like wow, Juno away. has gone straight in with the toys. I got this snappy one. These guys are immediately playing yeah. together. This is Andy. First play date in Korea. I know, I know. This is amazing. Sorry. You'll be the big house. It was so nice to see her making friends as well. It was really sweet. And they're only communicating a very yeah. small amount through language. They just see each other as like fellow human beings. There's yeah. no cultural barrier there. There's someone else to play with. And they even have shared interests, you know. This kid's into dinosaurs. Guess what? There's other kids probably into dinosaurs. Yeah, because they they're can freaking kids dinosaurs. and they're human beings. Obviously, they, they love, love dinosaurs. dinosaurs. <laughs> They're all gone! Yo, you swallowed them whole! Oh, you're gonna put a ball in his mouth? Can you come show me your stickers? Wow, what's that? Oh, you wanna show Josh's? Oh, gone. Wow, you, these are your stickers. You guys have some very cool stickers. <laughs> Yeah, Juno's gonna put a sticker on you. Yeah, it's a little dinosaur. <laughs> wow, Juno, it's the Sorry, strawberries buddy. you brought. Strawberries. <laughs> <laughs> Juno, are you sharing? Are you sharing? It's for you. Oh. Yeah, I'm for you. Oh, he you oh, thank you very much. Here, you, uh, I, I use my sticks. Oh, you're going to use your chopsticks to eat. This is the first time ever using chopsticks. Two hands. Going for it. Two hands. Wow. 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 <laughs> you know, that's actually sometimes how I use chopsticks. Should we read? She comes to a Korean house once. <laughs> yeah, having a chopstick. That's hilarious. We didn't even teach her this. <laughs> this is the best kind of present, isn't it, Juno? One that you can consume yourself. Yeah, yeah. This is wanted to get some fruit. Do you love strawberry? Careful, Daddy! <laughs> Be careful, oh, Daddy! Be okay. careful, Daddy! Yeah, it's okay, he's down. Where's the camera now? Yeah! yeah. Big wave! 
Look at this. All clean. All clean. All clean. All I know about parenting in Korea is what I read in the newspaper, which is there aren't many kids. Wow. It's interesting. I see that as a social phenomenon, but at the same time, around me, there are so many kids. So right. I don't get to see that uh, on a daily basis. Right. Yeah, yeah. But because of that, I think there's more pressure on parents to be really awesome parents. <laughs> really? Sure have, I made this relatively rare decision to have kids. Right. So I might as well do a good job. There's such an embarrassingly low bar, I think, for men. It, like in the UK, it's like if you do like the bare minimum of your responsibility, everyone like celebrates you as some kind of hero. Yeah, there are some easy points to score in Korea for dads. Yeah. Which is unfortunate. It is unfortunate because Lizzie's, you know, an amazing parent and doesn't get celebrated in the same way. My New Year's resolution this year is I'm going to take one morning off a week just to spend time, just me and her. I think I've realized it's actually just a privilege to be a parent. I don't know what it's like over here, but in England, a lot of parents complain about being parents. It's easy to fall into that sometimes because it is tiring and it is, it's inconvenient, right? It's like the mother of all inconveniences, <laughs> having children. But then it's like amazing as well. It is. I mean, you can of course never justify how sleep deprived you are, how tired you are all the time. But yeah. at the same time, the joy you get is amazing. Wow. Yeah. And being a parent, you get an excuse for wearing socks like this. I know, man. Look at this. I don't need an excuse. This is how I roll. This is how you are. I, when I die, I'm going to be buried in loud socks. Okay. Wait, what yeah. is happening? <laughs> <laughs> We're having very different conversations. <laughs> That's funny. Ooh, what's oh, that? Oh, she's sharing chocolate. What do you say? Thank you, little boy. <laughs> Thank, Thank you, little, little boy. boy. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, this is great. Thank you so much for having us. Yeah. Mm. yeah. Another thing that two-year-olds have in common, they freaking love cameras. <laughs> yeah. Making sure it's working. Little cameraman. Thank you, you. Good job. He's gorgeous. <laughs> so sweet. He's so sweet. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, is that your camera, June? Wow. Can you take a picture? Oh, you, are you checking out the camera angle? <laughs> nice. You sort it out, buddy. Man, you've got two little cameramen here. Yeah, they're used to cameras. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And when we said we were gonna go, and uh, sorry, she's just she's you know she's directing. Camera. You're doing a bit of directing. Oh, yeah. Oh, again, move it back, move it back. It? Oh, oh no, that's too far. Too oh. far. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Very good, Juno. Very good. Oh no, where are you going? Where are you going? <laughs> oh, okay. okay. Big <laughs> fingerprints. Huge smudges fingerprint. on you just need to kind of create a safe environment where they feel loved and cherished. Yeah. And then they'll just do the rest. So I knew that she was gonna have a great time. So I didn't cute. know that Hyonu is literally the master of fun. <laughs> that he had hired yeah. a bouncy yeah. castle. Oh my god. That was nuts. That was nuts. What the heck? He basically his house became almost on par with the kids' cafe. Yeah. If not better, because she was playing with other kids yeah. as well. Juno, it's gonna be a little bit loud, okay? Like that. It's a bit loud. Like that. What's that, Juno? What's that? That was crazy. That was crazy. Gosh. 
Yeah, let's do it. Yeah, let's, let's do it. Come on, Tifa. And you'll stay here. <laughs> Can you say honoren? Uh, <laughs> get <laughs> Last episode of the series. We hadn't tried Korean barbecue yet. Today we are gonna eat Yangnyom Sogaibi. Sogaibi. Wow. We're gonna have a bit of water. One shot. 